400. At 22, Carl F. Galtz gave a proof of the fundamental theorem of this math branch that uses variables to stand for numbers. Colby, what's algebra? That's it, 800. Here's my point. Simon Stebbins' 1585 pamphlet, The Tenth, helped establish the use of this notation. Roger? What is a decimal point? Yeah. Uh, 1,200? You can use these two symbols to show that Thomas Harriot's book introducing them appeared not in 1630 or 32, but 31. Pam? What are... Oh, oh sorry. Colby or Roger? Roger? What are greater than and less than? That's it. 1,600? In between loaves of bread, jugs of wine, and thou's, he came up with the first complete solution of cubic equations. It was Omar Khayyam. And now the last clue. A paradox named for this Greek says you can never reach a goal because the number of halfway there points is infinite. Colby. Who's Zeno? Zeno is right, and that takes you to 11,000.